Welcome to the weekend. Only where a weather threat we have is some surf for the north and west shores. We'll go over those numbers in a bit. The storm system that brought us heavy rain moving farther away, but it was still close enough to the Big Island today to bring some heavy rain and thunderstorm activity to the Puna district, but that is all cleared out and mostly dry weather with cool temperatures remain. There's going to be a lot of moisture surrounding the islands. I don't see much of the heavy rain moving in, so it looks like we're going to have a mostly dry Saturday and a mostly dry Sunday. Now, now, we could see maybe a stray shower or two pop up, but overall rainfall accumulation is not going to be much until this thing moves through. And this is weather for Monday night and in through Tuesday. That's another cold front. Tonight, very light shower activity. There's some showers that have been moving in from the northwest, uh, but not a problem whatsoever. Things do remain cool because we have northerly winds, mostly dry situation for Maui County, as well as the Big Island after these heavy rains, these thunderstorms were popping up over the Puna district. It's quiet for now. In surf, we have a high surf advisory tomorrow, but tonight it's still a high surf warning. Tomorrow, 14 to 18 for the north, 9 to 12 for the west. South shore, 1 to 3, but box jellies could be there. So if you're going to dip your toes in the water and you don't want to get stung, check with ocean safety officials. They'll let you know because sometimes they don't pop up. Sometimes they pop up a lot. Uh, the weekend still looking cool. Nice game day weather for Sunday. If you want to do anything outdoors this weekend, next round of wet weather is late Monday. Another cold front arrives, southerly winds, and then we get the cold portion of the cold front on Tuesday and Wednesday.